New York City are playing Minnesota in the MLS on the 30th. Now, I don't know the MLS at all, but I don't need to. With statistical betting, as long as I have data, then I'm good to go. So I'll just hop over to soccer stats. Go to scored conceded. And here's my data. So New York City, on average, score 2.13 goals at home and concede 1.13. The league averages are 1.78 for the home team and 1.03. So the home team typically scores more and wins. The away team, Minnesota, away on average score 1.13 goals and concede 2.88. Once we have this data, we can plug it in into our football simulator. So we just plug in the numbers like this and see what statistics are generated. This suggests that we're going to get many goals, since the average is nearly 4.7. The home team is expected to score nearly three and a half goals and the away team slightly more than one. The home team is expected to win nearly 80% of the time. We expect three or more goals over 80% of the time. In fact, we expect four or more goals nearly 70% of the time. So that's what we expect based on our simulator. Again, we're testing the simulator. So, you know, just, just because the simulations are saying the home team wins uh, 78, 79% of the time, does that actually match with reality? That, that's the point of this series of videos. For example, in the last match, we lost. The simulator suggested that the home team was going to win, but they didn't. At the same time, the home team dominated the game. They had 20 shots on target against two or something like that, but the away team score twice and the home team didn't score at all and that's the joy of football it is random so part one is to do the simulations and see what we find step two is to look at the betting markets to see does or do the markets agree with what we find and basically then look for value bets so home win is 78-79% so the fair value then would be one point two six but the betting markets are giving one point four four so there's a twenty percent nearly difference there's twenty percent value so if this simulator is accurate then we'd expect to typically be making ten or twenty percent profit if we kept betting on games like this likewise 
if I look at the three or more goals. So three or more goals, the fair value is 1.18. If I look at OLBG, so New York to win is 1.44, while we expect it, while we estimate that the fair value is 1.27. So think that these odds are too generous. If I look at the three or more goals odds, the bookies are giving 1.4, while our estimate is 1.18. So again, there's a 20% value. So that's worth backing. Fingers crossed.